Hello, everyone. Ten years after the United States and Vietnam launched our comprehensive partnership, we built a relationship that's dynamic, consequential, and growing stronger every day. Our countries are working together on an incredibly broad range of shared interests to the benefit of our peoples and people across the region and world. This past spring, I returned to Vietnam for my first visit as Secretary of State to expand and deepen that collaboration and to celebrate the important progress that we're making together. Together, we're promoting inclusive economic opportunity and through the Indo-Pacific Economic Framework, leading a race to the top on the issues shaping the 21st century economy, like digital connectivity, resilient supply chains, fair trade, and infrastructure. We're advancing the clean energy transition and helping Vietnam reach net zero by 2050, while powering sustainable development and strengthening public health systems. We're growing the ties between our people, which are the foundation of our relationship, enabling more students, researchers, entrepreneurs, and tourists to collaborate and travel between our countries. We're also working together to advance our shared vision of a free and open, prosperous, secure, connected, and resilient Indo-Pacific. As we look to the future, we remain focused on addressing the legacies of war. We'll continue to remove unexploded ordnance, clean up dioxin hotspots, account for the missing, among other joint efforts. For the United States, that's a matter of trust and a matter of duty. While in Hanoi, I had the opportunity to join my Vietnamese counterparts to break ground on our new U.S. Embassy, a state-of-the-art facility worthy of our ambitious vision for our partnership. I'm so grateful to everyone, Vietnamese and American, working to make that vision a reality. And I can't wait to see where the next 10 years takes us together.